working with site models is more accurate and intuitive than ever. A new, interactive feature within the site model makes it easier to identify and correct conflicts within your site model. These indicators, which appear to mark any errors during validation, are part of the object selection process, so they will only appear when the site model is actively selected. We've also added two new items to the site model's object info palette. The first item is the error count, which will show you the number of errors found. The second item is a Show Errors checkbox, which can completely disable the error indicators if desired. Whether by angle, percentage, or ratio, the Varied Batter Slope option in the Pad from Grade Limits tool provides greater control when setting terrain-modifying pads on your site. You can enter this value in one of three ways, Angular, Rise Over Run, and Percent. Finally, the Landscape Area tool now calculates areas based on the surface slopes of any site model. This improvement allows for the accurate measurement of a surface area rather than a simple projected surface area as was used before.